But the problem with sin is it's so easy to see it in your neighbor. And when it comes to seeing it in yourself, you go blind. Sin is something that is so easy to see in your friend, but it's nearly impossible to see it in you. And the reason why it's hard to see a sin in you, it's not because there is no sin, but it's for the same reason it's hard to see dust in the room. It's not because there is no dust, there is no light. And when you bring the light, the dust comes. The light didn't bring the dust, light revealed the dust. And that's why what we need in our life is the light of Jesus Christ. When you draw closer to the Holy Spirit, He doesn't remind you of your sin. It's just His presence is so holy that it makes anything that's not holy stand out to you. He can't treat His sin if He doesn't diagnose His sin properly. There was a man named Joseph and the Potiphar's wife jumped herself on him to have sex with him and Joseph replies back to her and he, he says this thing that you want to do right now is wickedness before God. Now it would be fine if Joseph would have been a disciple of Jesus. It would have been fine if Joseph would have been disciple of Moses. But there was no Ten Commandments. There was no law that would indicate that sleeping with somebody else's wife, actually your boss's wife, was a wickedness before God. Joseph runs from that. How could a man run from something that so many men today struggle with? Because in Joseph's world, lust was not weakness. Lust was wickedness. Most men today see lust and pornography as it's my weakness. It's not your weakness. It's your wickedness. We call abortion choice. We call homosexuality love. We call lust and pornography weakness. We can never defeat a sin until we call it for what it is. If you call cancer, fever, Advil, will never cure you of cancer. As long as it's weakness, issue, a struggle, this thing that I have, all the boys have it in the neighborhood. We all the men struggle with. You know what men struggle with? When they come to the gym and they can't lift 500 pounds. That's a struggle. Looking at porn is not a struggle. It's a wickedness. And until you see porn as wickedness, you will not defeat it. And the master says, you are wicked and it seems rude but you cannot defeat a sin that you don't identify with God's definition.